Marine Boldenii. I mean, quite a mouthful, and I don't think it's got a common name. Uh, but they're bulbs like this. A beautiful thing, but a pot full, well, in full flower, with those large, large red spidery flowers are beautiful. They really are. Now, as with all things Parkers, these are the best bulbs you can buy. 12 centimetre plus, an absolute cracker. And they're so easy. A little bit like Agapanthus, like good drainage, because they're from South Africa. So if you, if you find out where the plant originates from, that will give you a, a lot of indication. So good drainage in the bottom of a pot, and they certainly do do well in pots. Plant them a nice bit of multi-purpose compost. <clears throat> Any compost will do, just as long as it's multi-purpose and nice open aspect. Now, as, to, as regards the planting, couldn't be easier. They come in packs of six, and I think I'll probably put three in here rather than pack them in too tight. So I'll get two pots out of, out of one pack. And you really just place them in. Now, I always plant them so they're, be, they're below the compost level. But you can, if you like, and if you're a bit late on in the season, you can plant them so that the tip is just actually sticking out of the compost. And other than keeping them well watered, and it's really easy to do, other than keeping them well watered, that's all you have to do. It's as simple as that. There's some beautiful varieties around. Now, the palette of colours for Nareens is fairly limited, but they're all beautiful. There's a lovely, lovely pink one. Nareen Serensii Carusca Major. And now that's a bit of a mouthful, but a lovely, lovely deep red plant. Or Bodenii Isabel. If you're into white, Nareen Bodenii Stephanie. That's a lovely white one. But you can't go wrong with any of them. My favourite got to be the pink one. They're a lovely plant and a pot of these. They're not frost hardy, uh, so in the autumn time bring them in, keep them in a frost free place and don't forget year after year these are going to keep coming up a bit like your daffodils. Just give them a bit of care because they're from an exotic place and need a bit of care and attention but other than that they'll grow for fun and they look absolutely beautiful.